Okay, so you're probably wondering, well, so just what is a actual open education roadmap look like? And here's one on the wall behind me that I developed for the work that we're doing at the Open Education Consortia. So that you can see what, it, uh, what a finished roadmap might look like. And let me try to show you a few pieces, um, perhaps up close in a little bit more detail. So starting here on the left, um, we start with what it is that we have in place already. And each of these orange rectangles represents different initiatives that we have underway. And then to the left of them, as you can see, are descriptions of the assets, the people in community, the, uh, the operations and sustainability aspects of them, and the values, the value proposition and benefits associated with each of them. And so all of those have been documented down this side as a starting point for, for what it is that we, we have underway with our open education initiative. And then going forward over time, over a two year period of time, I've kind of mapped out a plan for each of those open education initiatives that take them forward in time. So how will the open education consortia itself evolve over time? And what are the components that are going to evolve? Is it the people in the community? Is it the operations and sustainability? Are we changing or enhancing value propositions in some way? I'm trying to document a bit of that. And then the black lines represent how the plan connects to the starting points of, pro of initiatives at the beginning or in some cases, like this particular example right here with the little kind of spikes on top, this is like a new initiative that isn't yet in place. So it's not got at the start, but it's something that I'm planning or imagining doing about a year out. And then across the bottom, um, I, I put in place for each of the four principal categories, what it is that I think we have for others that others might benefit from receiving from us and what it is that we need from others, how we might actually benefit from sharing from others who are doing open education initiatives themselves. So this is what an open education uh, roadmap looks like when it's finished. It's kind of, uh, it's super useful actually as a way for depicting what you're doing and for talking to others about what it is that you could do together. And so I hope you'll engage in this activity, have fun with it, make them roadmaps your, your own and, uh, and Please make sure you do a roadmap and we really want to document all the roadmaps that get produced at the summit.